Hello friends, this video on fun with magnets part 1 is brought to you by examfear.com. No more fear from exam. Topics to be covered in this lesson are Introduction, Magnet, Discovery of Magnet, Magnetic and Non-Magnetic Materials, Poles of Magnet, Magnet Finds Directions, Different Types of Magnets, Attraction and Repulsion Between Magnets, so, before we have fun with magnets, you might be interested or curious to know what a magnet is. Now, have you ever noticed that sometimes if you bring objects like nails or any other objects made up of iron especially, when you try to bring them near an object, what happens? They try to stick to that object. They get attracted towards that object. No. So, right now you don't know what that object is, but it is like a small piece of some heavy metal like thing. That's how it appeared to be. But whenever you bring uh, some specific metals near it, like iron nails, so these nails tend to get attracted towards that object. Not only that, if you have ever noticed a magnetic compass, I mean, this is uh, a small dial which looks almost like the dial of your wristwatch but it doesn't show you time instead it tells you directions that which is north which is south so it, it has a needle within it and this needle points in the directions so what is this needle i mean how does that needle detect directions so these are interesting stuffs think of a screwdriver have you ever seen a screwdriver? You must have. I mean, it is a, it is something which is very commonly uh, kept in houses because it helps you to, you know, screw and unscrew little stuffs in your house. So if you look at the tip of the screwdriver, so there is some magic at the tip of the screwdriver that whenever you bring these kind of objects like iron nails near it, they tend to get attracted towards it. Think of the doors of the trains not the not all the trains of course but uh, mostly the metro so if you have ever been into the metro in delhi or calcutta or mumbai so in the metro trains you would see that how the doors get closed i mean the doors get closed on their own I and mean, there is something due to which the two doors get attracted towards each other as they come nearer so not only the doors in metro trains, but a lot of in, in a lot of other places. For example, when you look at uh, the refrigerators or even the glass doors in many companies or malls, you see that they tend to get the two slides of the door when they come nearer. They tend to get attracted to each other. So wherever you are seeing these kind of attraction, there is no magic. There is a simple science behind. So you talk about the CDs or you talk about the fridge magnets. So have you ever seen that there are some small, small objects, maybe some cartoons or some pictures and they, whenever they, you take them near the surface of the fridge, they stick to the fridge. So we often call them as fridge magnets. So why do they stick to the body of the refrigerator? What special is there behind these objects? So in each of these examples, you see that there is some object which is trying to attract some certain objects. So this object which has this property of, uh, you know, kind of attracting certain materials, this object is a magnet. And magnet is widely used in various applications. For example, you look at uh, various electrical devices, whether you talk about uh, the generators, the motors. So you see that magnet play a very important role inside them. So we will not get into that detail. But here in this lesson, I'll just introduce magnet, what a magnet is, what are the basic properties of a magnet. So, so we will just have a very brief introduction of magnet. So what is a magnet? It is an object that exhibits a property to attract certain materials towards itself. Now please make a note of it that it can attract only certain materials and not all. So please do not think that if you have a magnet you can attract anything and a human being will not get attracted towards the magnet or a piece of paper will not get attracted towards the magnet. So there are certain specific materials 
which only get attracted towards a magnet but why the magnet attracts those specific materials and what are those specific materials so we will learn about them gradually step by step so the best example of magnet that you can think of is the fridge magnet so maybe uh, if if any one of you have never uh, seen a magnet so i think this would be the most easily available magnet so if even if you don't have it in your home so you can just go to any shop and you can ask for a fridge magnet and then you will see that it's like a any picture or statue or something and it behind it there is a small magnet so as you bring it near the refrigerator it sticks to the refrigerator so again why it sticks to the refrigerator because the body of the refrigerator is made up of iron so again as i said there are only certain materials which get at Similarly, if you have a screwdriver in your home, then just have a, observe the tip of the screwdriver. Now, let me ask you something. Why do we use screwdriver? So, mostly when you want to say screw up something, maybe screw up in the sense when you want to fit a screw into something to fit two different parts of uh, any object or when you want to remove separate the two parts then sometimes you want to unscrew it so what happens is even the, these kind of uh, nails so these are also made up of iron so these materials get attracted towards this tip of the screwdriver so that helps the screwdriver to do its job so here also you see that the tip has a, it is actually a magnetic tip. So there is a small magnet at the tip of the screwdriver. So just try it out yourself. Just try to bring some iron nails near the tip of a screwdriver and you will see that the nails tend to get attracted towards it. So these are some very common examples of magnets. So just try to observe them and try to see the this beautiful property of magnets. So this will help you to understand what a magnet is. Thank you. Please visit www.examfear.com to watch more educational videos with a better experience. Please do not forget to like and subscribe to our YouTube channel for latest updates. Thank you once again.